So I guarantee you are not alone, honestly. This is why I'm doing this video, because I had to Google it. So this is gonna save you a Google and you're gonna see it visually as well. So exactly how to like invoke cellular onto the Apple Watch. Now, I've been out the Apple Watch game for quite some time. I've been running my Garmin Epix Gen 2 Black Sapphire, absolute beast of a watch. I'm doing a comparison review on the Apple Watch and the Garmin watch coming up soon because I'm off down to Wales this weekend and I'm gonna take it hiking and let's see what happens. Anyway, this is how to get the cellular option on your Apple watch. First of all, I know it may sound stupid, you need a cellular plan. This is in addition to your current plan on your iPhone. This is for UK, okay? I'll just stick with the UK because I know the ins and outs of it for the UK. So I'm with EE on my iPhone 15 Pro and I had to get an additional cellular plan for the Apple Watch Ultra 2, which is seven pounds a month, okay? So rolling contracts, you can cancel at any time. Do you need it? Subjective, I, I, I don't know yet, I've got it. Access your options, you're gonna click the, the side button here. And as you can see, if it's white, that means you do have a cellular plan active, but you're just not using cellular at the moment, okay? So we need to like force it to use cellular. Now, the only real way you're gonna do that in normal conditions is when you're out of range of your phone or out of range of a Wi-Fi connection, an approved Wi-Fi connection. So as you can see here, I've got Wi-Fi. So I'm gonna turn off my Wi-Fi there but it's still connected to my phone via Bluetooth. So it's, you do still have that connection. So we need to chop this connection. So I'm just gonna go into my phone. I'm gonna hit on aeroplane. You can see sometimes Bluetooth does stay on. So you need to turn that off separately. So now I'm away from my phone. All I've got is my Apple Watch out and about in the wild i'm doing a run and listening to music so it may take a couple of minutes but basically we're waiting for that icon there to go green and give you like a 3g 4g or 5g and there we go that was perfect timing so as you can see there now we have dedicated cellular on the apple watch ultra 2 but then as soon as i come back and I'm going to turn off that you can see because now because it's connected via Bluetooth the cellular option has gone again now because it's now using this for connection so that's it really really simple I say simple in the loosest terms possible because I had to google it myself but yeah done.